really freaking pink. It's really hot in there. It's really... I had my eye on this fabric for a long time. I really like what it does in the light. It becomes totally something else. Pretty amazing. The only problem is that it's just really slippery. So for partnering, I hope. <laughs> well, Kumiko tried a little bit, and it didn't. Um, it didn't rip or anything. But Yan had a slight trouble lifting. But he was quickly changing the grip, which is good. I hope everybody can do that. <laughs> See what it's like a little bit. Not much. <clears throat> you know, I put a whole black in here and it's still like it's so little. So that's it for now. Let me go back downstairs and see what the if David changed the lift, so I have to think more about the design. So you're here, right? And when you go, you do that, that, through. So somehow you're going to have to go this, this, there. That's kind of what I think. Anybody else have some suggestions? My coming here kind of arose out of a need to have somebody help and actually counteract David in the process because of course when you're a choreographer and you're trying to uh, set things and step away from them and get the bigger picture, sometimes you can't always attend to certain things and uh, have the time to take people slowly and go through step by step. And I wanted to help David certainly in the early processes because that's always the hardest is the teaching. And then I think the piecing together is not necessarily less difficult, but at least everybody has the material learned. So you take oh, that on. And then uh -huh. you're fine. You, you don't see. have to worry. They're the what they're gonna the do. I'm not worried, I'm just, I'm just no no, just so you know. Yeah. As they're doing forward, see, I'm coming to you, right? I'm traveling yeah. forward, you're traveling back. Mm -hmm. So it's my responsibility to hook up with you when I know. <laughs> no, 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 it's, you're going slow motion. You have plenty of time to think. The classically trained dancer knows exactly where the body is supposed to be. And sometimes in that knowing, your body wants to respond a certain way and then you're asking for a different coordination. You know, how do I do my arms before my legs or my hips before my arms? a lot. Great. Okay. In the um, donkey costume? What am I gonna wear? They're ready both, so uh, maybe you should wear it once. Try it. This one's too much. It's just pink and this and that and green. And that. Yumiko, she's typecast in this company as the fast and furious, you know, she's like Speedy Gonzalez and, and, I, and she's a turner. You know, she's someone who turns very easily, so her repertoire in the company is Don Quixote and just virtuosity, you know. And I didn't want to give her any virtuosity. I wanted to see something else from her because I know that she has more to offer. I think that's the same for everybody. So I, I gave us just like a couple of turns in there, but they're not independent turns either. She's someone who can whip off just like four pirouettes, easy. And the same with Sophia. Anyway, I didn't want this piece to be about technique either. 
so the emphasis on a turn is not that it's a turn it's just that you you go around you go the long way around to get somewhere else all the way around to get there and that's just you could call that a turn and you know it depends how they do it too they could be like on point actually doing a turn but essentially it's not really a, a virtuosity piece and i don't want i didn't want the piece to be hard technically i want it to be expressive that's all <laughs> now you to bring your leg down then. <laughs> now. Whoa! Maybe do it along the back. Yo. Spawn. Spawn. And without that hand. Spider-Man. Let's call it Spider-Man. This it? Yeah. Boom. Boom. No, that's not Spider-Man. You're doing... What? You're doing... Me. Diana Ross. Diana Ross? Spider-Man. Oh, you mean web. that? The web. Oh, okay. So you want to go webs. <laughs> you ready? Because we did so many things. I have to be able to squeeze it all in there somehow. All yeah, that stuff. I don't want to look like a, like a maniac. No, I'm sorry. I'm not bad. I gotta work that shit out. We have to really work this shit out because we got different rhythm. I got smaller circle than he does, you know? So the rhythm in my head is going boom, and he's going you know what I mean? So it, it takes a lot of work for us, yeah. That's more like it. And then... dance it's a, it's a need you know everyone dances to celebrate you know everyone's going to discos on a Saturday night and they're actually having fun doing it and my problem with my career was that I felt like I trained away that feeling it all became about technique and what somebody else wanted from me and it just became a series of steps so I'm trying to get away from that with this piece always try to undo the ballet in a way, make things more strange, disorientate, displace, disengage. Dance like no one is watching, we've all heard that before. Dream the shape of the movement. You know? Boneless, fragile, careful, reluctant, graceful, strong. Spiritual, expressive, yearning, extended, large, rounded, circular and searching. 
Great. <laughs>